yo yo what's up can you hear me though can you hear me that's what i need to know uh is there a way to move the chat so we can see the video and the chat at the same time well i see it on my my screen i see the chat and i see the screen at the same time so what's up liam jean francois david the shine yes i can john yes i can john we hear you oh okay yeah yeah right okay good 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 well welcome 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 this is our first official cgc unboxing event on youtube facebook and i think twitter periscope i'm not sure if it's actually working or not but we are live we are broadcasting simultaneously everywhere hold phone straight i'm not holding the phone um what's up john uh matt matt what's up brian yeah so we're we got some new things maybe michael i don't know whose books they are i don't know i don't know so we're trying some new things out um i hope you like it um it's really just the beginning so you know we're having fun and we're trying new things so bear with us okay uh Criticism is always appreciated, <laughs> um, but uh, be easy on me, be easy. Are these books that we can claim? No, these are not books that you can claim. I do have some CGCs for the end of the show that I'm going to show, but these are, I have three boxes. There should be 25 in each box, and we can, yes, they just came in. They just came in on Friday, so uh, we're going to share these. I'm so excited. I just can't hide it. You know, you know, you know. So we have three three boxes. And how we determine, what's up, Nino? So how we determine the shipment is we give it a tag, CGC, and then the day of the year. So today, example, is the 213th day of the year. These CGCs were sent out on the 100th the 104th and the 114th day. So you can see that it took literally 100 days to come back. So there you go. That's 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 how you determine uh, the, the time it took for these CGCs to come back. So here we go. Oh, I was going to put on um, a little background music just because as, you know, Tell me if it's if the music is too loud. Let me know. I just wanted something in the background. Uh, I put that I for now. All I have is that lo-fi hip hop radio, but I think that works. So, okay. Anything for sale? Yes, there will be stuff for sale. But after after we finish the uh, the show. So today it's really just an unboxing. We're trying out YouTube. Um, everything is new for us. So. So like I say, bear with us, and uh, hopefully this can be fun. Can't put music on YouTube. You get, uh, well, this is the lo-fi uh, hip-hop radio. So I think this is, um, I think you're allowed to play this. As far as I know, we are. So, okay, so here we go. First box. Not going to keep you too long. It's probably going to take about 45 minutes to go through these boxes. I'm just going to show them off. I'm not going to tell you who they are because I can't remember. Oh, but I wanted to do something to start the show. Hola. Well, let's let's wait. Let's let's keep going and see who sticks around. If you stick around, you're gonna you're in for a surprise. Is all I'm gonna say. So this is the CGC box. It holds 25 books. Um, this is this is. I see some turtles. I see some aliens. I see turtles and aliens. Okay, so this is from the 104th day of the year. Um, hey, have a public domain music. Yeah, Mini, is that YouTube version? Um, James Dewar, Mark Bird, hola, Mini. Okay, so I see Steve Lemure and Michael Amel and Mark Bird. You guys are all on YouTube. I see Ben Deceve, Stéphane Caron, and Jean-Francois Bouchard. You're all on Facebook. Dominic Palazzo is on YouTube. So I have something really special for you guys that are on YouTube coming up in a minute. So 
if you're not on YouTube, you need to go and subscribe to the channel, uh, you know, and, you know, help help us out, man. We, we need to deliver some content to grab some new people that don't know about Far Side Comics. So that's what we're going to try to do right now. Here we go. So this is uh, 25 books, like I say. Uh, let's see what we got. We'll just do random, random pulls. The Ryan Brown Alien, 9.8. That's a hot book. That was an exclusive? Yes, it was an exclusive from Comics Elite, so very nice. Yeah, something special. It was always good. Ooh, oh, 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 whose book is this? Man, I hope this is my book. I doubt it, though. Whew. DC Presents, DC Comics Presents number 47, Superman and the Masters of the Universe, 8.0. Oh, wow, what a beautiful book. That That is beautiful. So far, this is my favorite. Who's, 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 who has, tell me when you get a favorite. This is my favorite. Hey, King, what up? Philip, like the video on YouTube? Yeah, man, a lot of people doing YouTube videos out there, and I think we have something to offer. Ooh, look at that. Strange Academy number one, 9.6. Very nice. This is a first appearance of Emily Bright, Doyle, Shaley, Kelvin, Desi, Zoe. Oh, man, so many people in here that are new uh, first appearances. If you don't have this book, try to get it now. That He-Man was fire. Yeah, that's my favorite so far. That's mine. Oh, Michael. Michael's finally getting books back. Uh, geez, man. Michael sent these out 112 days ago. Uh, ooh, Stefan. Stefan Caron. I know that's yours. Whoa. You guys might not be on this series, but God of War is definitely coming to a TV near you someday. Yeah, who, huge start. Twitch over from Facebook. There you go. Well, at the end of this box, we got something for you. All you YouTube people. Ooh, another alien number one, Ryan Brown. So these are most likely off the website, just people that uh, purchased and added CGC. You can do that on the website, guys. Um, if you don't know, um, it's really, really easy. Um, all you have to do is when you're trying to choose a comic book. So as you can see here, you can see Allison. Let me make that bigger. You can see Alice in Wonderland or Leatherland. Okay, sure. All you need to do is come down here and you can add the CGC automatically to your purchase or the fast track. Uh, we used to have top loaders. Unfortunately, they're no longer available. But, um, you know, one day. So, yeah. Um, that He-Man. So nice. Okay, let's go. Let's see what else is in here. Oh, Star Wars Darth Vader number three. That's a big one. All right. That's a big one. First appearance in there. Whew. That's that's a runner up for my favorite just because uh ooh Young Avengers number 1 9.8 that's huge that's a huge book right now that's a huge book right now my goodness what's up e money e money chilling man yeah it's sunday afternoon and we're just showing off some slabs i guess and maybe going to sell a couple um Oh, 9.2 TMNT Adventures, number one. This is from Archie, Archie Publications, 1988. Nice book. Yeah, big money books. Yeah, they're not mine. <laughs> I don't have no big money books. My big money book is, uh, ooh, look at this one. Ooh, this must be from the website, too, I think. Harley Quinn, number one. Harley Quinn, number one. Nice looking book. Mine as well. Okay, he has a couple books in here, Mike. Oh, that's. I'm gonna hold on to that one. I'm gonna hold on to that one. Ooh, oh, oh, this is all Mike's. What the heck? Uh, oh, this is mine. I think. This is mine. This is mine. Um, we tried to sell this and nobody wanted it. 
So I sent it in, and it's supposed to be a hot spec book, uh, maybe not on everybody's radar, but Spider Woman Revealed to be Scroll Queen Varanki Wraparound Cover. Oh, look at that. There she is. Hope you can see that. A little bit of a glare. There you go. That was uh, pressed by us. Yeah, I sent in 25. Whoa, Harley, that's going to be big offer uh, after. Yeah, it could be. Yeah, it could be. Uh, let me just uh, set this up for you guys. Uh, da, 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 I don't want to mess this up. Hold on a sec. Okay. There you go. Grant. Okay, uh, by the way, if you don't know, let me take James's comment out of there. How do I get that? No, 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 no. No, 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 no. Okay, well, James's comment is going to stay there for now. Uh, banners? James, get out of there. Okay, well, then I'm going to show that after when I figure out how to get rid of James's comment. Damn it. Had to be James. I was trying to show you the show, the turnaround times. As you can see, it got lower again. It's to 102. Um, but the problem is here. This is the problem. They're only opening books that have been delivered as of May 24th. So that means that they're over a month behind in just opening the books. So I hope that gives some uh, clarity. Where is Jay? Uh, I master the comments. Yes, I see that. Now it's Brian. Yeah, I put Brian, I'm trying to put, let me see. Uh, put user on timeout. Ah, oh, <laughs> Steve, I was, I'm not gonna put you on timeout, sorry. <laughs> Uh, nice covers. Will you be doing a CBS? Yes, CBCS. Okay, that one's mine. Okay, moving on. What else do you got? We got a lot of books here. It's YouTube. We got time. Batman 107. Ooh, the 1 in 25 variant. That's a beauty. That was somebody off the website, I think. Oh, another one. Another one, that's two, two, two for two nine point eights. Uh, oh, another alien. So that was popular. The Ryan Brown alien, we sold a lot on the website. Um, and it, it, a lot of people wanted it CGC. So go figure. Oh my goodness. All I see in here is Star Wars. Uh, how about Star Wars Adventures? Adventures, the Clone Wars, number five. Got Darth Maul, Maul. This is a surprise comics edition. Don't know too much about that. If you send a single express book or SS book with the rest of modern, yeah, I'm not going to try that. Somebody else told me that. I, I'm not going to try that. Oh, another one. Where did these come from? Who sent in two of these? Uh, Star Wars Adventures, The Clone Wars, number five. Another one. Interesting. I think that's uh, Eric's. Ooh, Star Wars, Heir to the Empire, number one. That might be Michael's as well. I'm not sure. Yeah, nice. Nice books. Uh, ooh, Star Wars, Darth Maul, son of Darth um, Dathomir, number one. I don't know who these are. Uh more Star Wars, yeah. A lot of Star Wars is, is what's hot. Oh, some more turtles. TMNT number one. Fourth printing, 7.0. Nice. He says yes. I think it might be his. Um, okay, up next. Oh, more Star Wars. Star Wars number two. Part two of Star Wars, A New Hope movie adaptation. 9.0. Beautiful book. Uh, you got some big characters on the front. Very cool. Oh, now this one. Was it this one? Mm, I don't think so. 
No, it's not this one. Okay, Harley Quinn number 11 from DC Comics. Hey, Pino, what's up, man? We're doing some unboxing. A little bit of a glare, but 9.2 on that. TMNTs. I wish I had a, I wish I have that fourth print. Yeah, I know, right? Oh, this one's too nice to show right away. These are all nice. I don't know which one to show first or last. Uh, ah, okay, let's, okay, this one we showed already. Okay. Uh, is this the Micah Mel box? I don't know. I It might be, it might be a little mix. Uh, Star Wars, number one, the big one. Uh, part one of Star Wars A New Hope, 7.0. Oh, this one's nice. Star Wars Bubba Fat, the Wizard uh, Con, uh, first Obi Wan in Star Wars Two. Yes, look at this. They didn't put it on the label though. You know, you think they could do that? Um, yeah, this is the mail away exclusive. You had to mail in for this one. Nine point eight. Uh, ooh, this one first appearance of Cade Skywalker. Shadow, oh man, there's a lot of first appearances in this one. Star Wars Legacy, number one. It was pretty mashed up. You can see why it got a 6.5, a lot of color breaks. But it's still a beautiful book, and it's still a, a major key book. Star Wars Jedi versus the Sith, number one, 9.8. That looks like a hot book for sure, Lucas Books. And the last one, a 9.6 Wolverine 88. That might be mine. I'm not sure. Might be mine. I sold my 98 um, months ago, and I was so disappointed. I'm wondering if some of mine are in there. Well, we have two more boxes to go, so it might be. I I'm, I didn't look to see who's who. I just came on here to. To, to show off what we got we're going to be processing these today or tomorrow so that's what's up yeah some hot books some hot books most of them are michael's i guess okay next up don't know which one we're going to pull first So these are books that we, uh, like I said, we sent these out. Um, we sent these out over a hundred days ago. All right, so we're done the first box, and here we go. For all you people that stuck around to watch me talk about uh, graded books, and we do have, I believe, we have two. Two uh, books that we're going to see what happens with um, in this, these boxes. I have a Kanto number one, 9.4, and an Atman number two, Incentive, which is uh, one of my personal spec books, just because of all the first appearances in there. Um, so there you go. We're going to look at those. Hopefully, they're in these boxes. Claim John's T-shirt. Man, you guys always taking my clothes and stuff. Okay, I just want to be able to take this comment out of there. Can I do that? Can I do that? How do I get his comment? How do I get his comment out of there? Hey, if you don't know, celebrating 20 years of free comic book day um this is pretty big this year there's a lot of hot books if you don't know about a uh, new comic book day a uh, free comic book day um this is an opportunity for you to get some free books and to visit your local comic shop and support them and maybe bring some family members that don't know about comic books so introduce them to what you enjoy and in order to do that we have a whole bunch of free comic books that day. If you're local, you're going to be taken care of. And if you're online, you're going to be taken care of. We're going to take care of everybody that day. It's Saturday, August 14th. But you have to be there either in person or online. So, And just to show you the kind of stuff that we're going to be doing, 
Um, I think we're going to have a spec pack with all the new uh, hot specs uh, from Free Comic Book Day available that day. I'm going to have some kind of game going on. Uh, if you don't know, now you know. But to start things off, I have 15 of these. And I am going to look on my screen because on my screen in the comments, I see who's on Facebook. I see who's on YouTube. And I am going to take the next 15 people that type house. But you have to be on YouTube. You can get one free. I'm going to try this first time. Got to type house to get a free comic. Sam. Mark. Oh, my goodness. Oh, my goodness. That just popped up on my screen. <laughs> oh, man. I'm going to have to scroll up, man. That was crazy. They just all popped up in a minute. Hold on. Woof. That was crazy. Okay, so that's how it's going to be, right? And you have to be on YouTube. You have to be a YouTube uh, viewer. So I see, I see Sam Cote. I see Mart M. Not sure who that is. Uh, Philip. I see Scott Neal. Hey, Scott. Uh, what can I say? I'm not. I'm going to write your name down, but I don't know who you are. Can I say? Some people are selling these books uh, like 20 bucks or something. I don't know. Not really supposed. And those are comic book stores, by the way. You know that, right? Because nobody else has these comic books. Okay. I got, what can I say? I got Stony. Um, oh, wait a minute. Sam Cote, you're on Facebook. You don't get one. I'm sorry. But that's not how it goes. Stony251981. And I got Elena. Sorry, guys. It took me by surprise how fast this went. Uh, Elena. Matt. YouTube. Elena. Elena. What? Can I? I got Nino. And I got Mark Burr. That's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, something like that. Uh, I can keep going. I got What Can I Say? I got you. Uh, Keith White, you're on Facebook. It does not count. Nicholas T does not count. I got Brian B and Dominic Palazzo. And I got who else? Who else? Who else? Ooh, David Deshine and Liam. Oh, wait a minute. Oop, 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 oop. You guys are still commenting. Hold on. I see you guys. Don't worry. Don't worry. With this, you don't have to type two times. Um, Brandon, Dominic, Scotty, Scotty, if you guys, if I don't recognize your name, you're going to have to message me after the show. Not now because I, I won't remember. Mike Amell, uh, Mart M, I got you. That's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, 10, 11, 12. That's 12. I need three more. Uh, Ben, I got Ben. Ben, Ben LaRouche, and I got Stoney, oh, Ryan Stone, okay, uh, Ryan Stone, I'll try to re write it down now, Mike Amell, I got uh, Ben LaRouche, what can I say, it's Sheldon, oh, okay, what can I say, it's Sheldon, um, I got some more surprises after too, maybe. Uh, Pudge83 and Larry J. Pudge83 and Larry J. I'll get a free uh, how, Enter the House of Slaughter. David Shine, nope. Nope, nope. Jean-Francois, okay, I'm back down to the bottom, guys. I'm at the top. E-Money, I don't see you, bud. It's Ben. Yeah. But whoever didn't get one, guys, don't worry. We have enough to go around, and uh, we might do this again in a minute or two. Uh, is there a lag? Because you called people at the middle of those who wrote House. Uh, great job, John. I'm getting into matinee to see Space Jam. Oh, nice. 
Well, I don't know. It's still new for me, this thing. Um, I was at the top. And I go down. I'm going to scroll. Let's see how this works. So, first one was, I'm on both. House, house. Yeah, you guys switch, though. Sean McDonald, David Deshine. Yes, James Dewar. Oh, okay, okay, okay. Yeah, I see you guys. I see you guys. Hold on. Hold on. I'm gonna take a snapshot because this is this is crazy. So I got uh, David Deshine, Sean McDonald, Ben LaRouche, Alexandre Bertrand, King Coffin, uh, Jean-François Bouchard. I got uh, Steve. I'm gonna scroll down a bit more. I got some extras. I'm gonna throw in there. Uh, E.S. Uh, Earl, I got you, uh, and then James Dewar, I got James Dewar too, so there you go, so I got all the people above Sam Cote, Sam Cote was not watching on YouTube, um, so that was part of the rule, was uh, you had to be messaging from YouTube, yeah, just trying to get people to subscribe, make sure to subscribe to us on YouTube, Share, share. We got some stuff coming, guys. Oh man, I love this platform. This is this is what's up. All right, let me get this off the screen. Um, there you go. So box number two. Yeah, but don't worry, guys. We have lots of those books. So if you, uh, this is the show on YouTube. Yeah, it's on YouTube, and it's me neither. What's me neither? You're not on YouTube? Well, get on YouTube, guys. Get on YouTube. It's uh, it's going to be... Um, I see you now, Don. I think you just jumped on. Yeah. Leg check. There you go, James. How fast was that, the leg check? Yeah. So, yeah, you guys, all you need to do is, is subscribe to us on YouTube. And um, we're going to be doing more of these kind of things. Yeah, like the video. Yeah, that's it there. Yeah, like the video. Thanks, guys. Really appreciate it. Okay, box number two. Which one is this? Oh, oh, there's my aunt, man. Um, this is um, this is CGC 100. So this was sent uh, CGC 100. So today is the 100th. The 213th day, so it took basically 110 days for us to send it and for it to come back. Uh, yeah, we're doing an unboxing on YouTube and on Facebook and on Twitter. We're, we're broadcasting everywhere. We're broadcasting everywhere. Well, you can go to Facebook and see us. It's just we're trying to get people to subscribe, Jason. Um, we, we might do some private shows on uh, YouTube. Um like after hours or something. Um, maybe we're going to do some FOC videos. Maybe we're going to do some more unboxing. I don't know. Whatever you guys like. Same lag as Facebook. Not bad with less restrictions and funny business. 110 days total or 110 days. Because today is the 213th day. And on my paper, I wrote CGC 100. So that means... Um, how do I comment on YouTube? I'm not sure, Todd. <laughs> I'm not even sure what I'm doing. Not yet, anyways. Not yet. So, you know, ask the group. It's uh, Really, we're just trying stuff out, you know. So, and right now, we're broadcasting on Facebook and Twitter as well, or Periscope, whatever. So, uh, we're everywhere. Um, I love Ant-Man, right? Okay, let's go. Ooh, some nice stuff in here. Shade craft. This looks like an incentive. I never even saw this one. It just came in the store and was sold online and sent out. What is this? It's a bit, oh cover cover B by Jock. Oh, it's a Jock variant. Nice. Under the video, click yeah. And I don't know how to get rid of these comments. Are we just looking at Unbox Slab? Uh, these are, we're looking at them, but I do have a couple books at the end of the 
show that I'm going to show some 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 slabs. There is a chat box below the video. Okay, another shade craft. Another shade craft. This was cover A by Lee Garbett. Lee Garbett. Um, another one. Another nine eight. So we always promise nine two or better on the website when you buy. But these books are, you know, in good shape. They're brand new, and we're very careful with them. And um, if I see that it's messed up, like really messed up, I'll do something for you. You know what I mean? Uh, another one. See, came back nine four. But that's why you, we say nine two or better. Unless we offer a 9.8. Oh, I'm sure, Steve. I've been watching tutorials for the last 48 hours on all types of stuff. So I'll figure it out. I just don't want to stop the show to, to figure it out. I'll just leave here. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to put that comment up so that people know. <laughs> you know? Okay, another uh, cover B, I guess. 9.8. Came back. Nice. Uh, yeah, I see a lot of people doing these types of shows, but I think we definitely have something to offer. Check this out. 9-8 Spider-Woman. This was purchased off the website. So, you know, even though we say 9-2 or better, it's not to scare you away, but it's, it's just a reality that, you know, we're not, we're not charging you to press books or nothing. I'm sure that 9-4, uh, Shadecraft could come back at 9-8 if we, we pressed it. Look at this one. Yosagi Ojimbo. Wanderers Road number five with Momoko. Isn't that beautiful? That's gorgeous. Yeah. Let me see something here. Put that. Oh, there we go. I figured it out. You have to click on the, the comment that you post. You have to click on it a second time, and then it comes off. Pretty easy. It's just that, like, when it when it first happened with James, his comment was so far away that I, I couldn't even find it if I wanted to. But I, get, I missed your lag check, Mace. Uh, scream, 9.8. Beautiful. King and Black Scream, number one. That's a beautiful cover by uh, In Hook Lee. I don't have a comment chat on the bottom for some reason. Well, it worked. I see your chat. I see your comment. Uh, nine eight, Amazing Spider-Man, Gleason, Virgin. Whew. What a beauty. That scream is mine, he says. It might be. It might be. It might be. I don't know. I don't know. Silk, 9.8, number one. This was also purchased off the website. This is the Bartell variant. Cindy Moon, very cool. Came back 9.8. That scream is mine. Hope so. Uh, Amazing Spider-Man 55, 9.8. Nice. Uh, okay, uh, Marvel Zombies. This is the variant from Arthur Sudiem, number one. So many of these are submissions you did for customers, I take it. Uh, yeah, yeah, most of them are not mine. I I try to only put one or two, maybe three or four in a box. I have I have a couple boxes come back that are a lot of mine, are, are mine. Um, but it's, it's too expensive if, if they're all mine. I can't, I can't send all these out. Oh, look at that one. Oh, and that one, and this one. Uh, whose is this? Avengers 257. Avengers 257 9.6. Could he, Kitty hook me up with that screen months ago? Hope it's mine. It probably is. Probably is. Probably. Probably. Uh, okay, another 98 Gleason Virgin. Number 55. Any older books? Any older books? I don't know. I, I don't know what's in here. Not older than 1975, anyway. Uh, Star Wars Adventures, number one. The uh, Jiang from IDW. Uh, here's a Darth Vader, number three, 
First appearance in there as well. Uh, this one here, uh, second print, Finch from 2009, Vengeance of the Moon Knight, number one, 9.2. Please tell me the Venom Gleason covers are in. I don't know. Is this for sale? No, this is, uh, we're just doing an unboxing, um, but we will have some shows for sale, uh, some books for sale at the end. I'm not sure what exactly yet. I have like maybe 10 available. Please, what's up? What's up, Rick? We're live. We're showing off uh, some new books. What a moon. I know, right? Finch kills Moon Knight every time. Um, cover A of the new Moon Knight is similar to that one. I think they were trying to give it like an homage kind of. Um, ooh, that's a nice one. Noctera. Second second print for Noctera number one. That's a beautiful cover. Claim the cardboard. Hmm. Okay, that you can have. I won't even charge you for it. Make sure to like the video, guys. Make sure to subscribe. Um, make sure to share. Ooh, Ultimate Fallout number four, 9.0. 9.0. That's still a thousand dollar book. 9.0 Ultimate Fallout number four which will only go up, in my opinion. Yeah, some good books, good variety. Um, Star Wars, Night of the Old Republic, number 42. Origin of Revan. Revan? Revan. Uh, oh. <laughs> okay, this one. So, we... 9.6 Ant-Man number two incentive. I love this book. Um, I have the regular cover, but I had my my incentive and I wanted a 9.8 and I was able to bump it up. Uh, I was able to bump it up to a to a 9.8. That's the one in 25 with multiple first appearances. It's too bad they don't put it there. But if we uh we look on key collector. We should be able to see what's up. Let's see. Let's see what we can see. So Ant-Man, here we go. So Ant-Man number two. So first appearance of Macro Thrax, first full appearance, Spectre of Hornets, uh, Silkworm Ghoul, and the Rhino Beetle Hulk. And there's our um, there's our our book that is now a nine eight. <coughs> How do they determine if you can bump it up? Um, how do we determine? We just take a chance. We crack the, the slab. I knew that that slab was never pressed when it was sent in the first time. So I uh, loving this interface. Yeah. Yeah, it's good. It's good. Um, yeah, so we just cracked it and sent it in. Uh, we're doing an unboxing. You can get a free, you can get one of those boxes, uh, Michael. I think we have uh, two or three extras in the shop somewhere. So just make sure to ask for it when you come in. Much better than Facebook. Really? Like you can tell a difference or what? Or just because the images, like what makes it better? What makes it better? Um, the sound, the video. We definitely have a high tech webcam. This one cost like over 200 bucks. So I, I didn't cheap out. Um, um, yeah. Okay. Let me get back to what's cracking. Okay, example, examine the book in the slab. If you see no damage, yeah, uh, well, it's, yeah, sometimes I'm telling you a lot of books you can get on the website that, um, not on our website, but like on, uh, on eBay that have little defects and you can easily bump them up. 
the camera makes it smoother. Yeah, it looks like we're in the future. <laughs> this, yes, we are definitely in the future, Philip, of Farside Comics live shows. Um, uh, I don't think so, Sheldon, but you never know. Uh, the camera, full screen camera doesn't move, so no more motion sickness. Yeah. Uh, where do you send these to get slapped? We send them to CGC, which is in Florida. We're located in Canada. And um, yeah, Sava JF? Yes, sir. JF, what's up? All right, I'm, I'm trying to get rid of these comments. Okay, okay, back to it. I see it now. Okay, this one's mine. It's going to go to the side with my Avengers. Ba, 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 ba. Okay, what else we got? Oh, let me show that one last. Uh, Batman 423 classic McFarlane cover. C class A, Rick. I see you, Ricky Royce. Uh, classic McFarlane cover 8.0. And we got um, one of these uh, that a customer was lucky enough to get. The customer was lucky enough to get one. Um, uh, Stefan, are you here? Stefan Carhon, I think this is yours. I'm not sure though. I hope I, I hope I don't get his hopes up and it's not his. I don't have my papers. Stefan, are you here, Stefan? You were here a minute ago. Stefan, Michael Amell, like my Star Wars books. Oh, yeah. Okay, well, while we're waiting for Stefan Kong, I'll check this out. Look at this. Kanto, number one, 9.4. Um, this is a pretty big book. It was a 9.4. Check this bump. 9.8. Look at that. Isn't that fun? That went from a $150 book to a $400 book something like that so that goes in there and there we go that's what's up so we were able to get a nine six yeah worked hard on that one though those contos are really messed up that's a good book you can get off ebay for cheap like a and, and uh and bump them up he likes the setup that's what's up yeah, it's it's nice. Wait till you see Tuesday night what we're gonna do after the show. If you guys are, are you, if you guys are part of the, uh, that's the canto that you guys pressed. Yeah, you can find pictures of it on uh, Instagram. Yeah, we do all right. We do all right. This one, this one's a good one. But I'm telling you, a lot of those cantos that were sent in were never pressed especially CBCS, because most of them came from Comics Elite. So shout out to Comics Elite, but they don't press their books, and they were all damaged. Like, everywhere they were damaged. So over a 1,000. There you go. Nice. Um, so so just funny story is that those CBCSs, there's a good chance that a large percentage of them are not pressed, and you can work on them. I don't guarantee a 9.8 because they're pretty messed up, but... You could definitely get a nine. You could buy a nine and get a nine six for sure. Uh, easy. Okay, Stefan Caron. I think this is his book. I hope it's his book because I don't want him to get too excited. And it's not his book. But he really likes Berserker. And he was lucky enough to get one of the uh, second prints. Uh, we were shorted. I think we, I think we had like 10 or something out of... Uh, 200 or something i forget what the numbers were but he got one he sent it in and he got a 9.8 i'm pretty sure it's stefan Caron. beautiful book this is gorgeous just gorgeous probably probably my favorite one of um of the series to be honest i mean i i never got past issue number one to be honest but um i liked issue one just didn't have time to keep going. So that's that. That's another box done, guys. Nice box. Nice box. Nice box. Nice box. 
have you hold on where did that comment go did i miss it uh you did good thanks uh john is an a swell dancer okay 9.8 on a black book is is like that is really good yeah one of the ten thousand variant boom makes yes but my favorite have you figured out the timer in the web app uh well we had a timer at the beginning of the show uh timer you mean like on the screen for auctions no not yet there's a lot of stuff that um we have not figured out we're just happy that we got this far along <laughs> For now, I'll take this and then work on the rest, right? I mean, uh, yeah, that, that's good for me for now. Okay, so next up, before we do the last box, yes, we can press and clean your books. We do a quick clean and press, which means we basically wipe her down and press her up, and it's $15.00. Oh, a timer. Yeah, I've seen some crazy stuff, Jason. There's a lot of cool stuff. Uh, it's $15 for a press and clean. Um, if you bring three or more, we charge $10. Um, and then bottom of the screen, there you go. There's the prices for CGC submissions uh, and fast track. And there's the pressing right there. $15. Bucks. You can email us at info at farsidecomics.com or, um, yes, it's Canadian. All prices are in Canadian. So, yeah, we just sent one in, Mace, uh, yesterday for somebody. It looked gorgeous. So let me see what I got going on here. I wanted to show you this because it's kind of a big deal. Um, this is House of Slaughter number one. We're offering you a spec pack for only $35. You should go and get this. Why? Because... It is the hottest book out, and having five covers of uh, e five of each cover is not a bad thing. So, make sure to check that out on the website. It's easy to find. You can just the search engine on um, on the website is very powerful. So you can see. There you go. Just have to press enter and it will show you all the items available for house of slaughter we got the one in tens we even have the one in 500 and we even put the one in 1000 up so don't miss out on this this is like when um something is killing the children came out and everybody was sleeping don't sleep now now now's your chance you can still get in when you They'll have the chance to get at the bottom of the of the uh, the pricing. Save that money now. Okay, up next, I got 15 more of these, and I'm gonna take comments from YouTube. Again, you have to write house. You gotta write house. I'm gonna let it go, and I'm gonna scroll up, and uh, there's the line right there. I just put a line. So who's going to claim, and not the same people, by the way, I, I don't want to give it to the same people. So I'm going to choose, I'm going to choose different people that haven't claimed already, just so that everybody gets one. All right. All right. So I see a lot of people uh, commenting. I'm going to scroll down. Woo. You guys are on fire. Jason B, you got to be on YouTube. This is for YouTubers, trying to get those YouTubers. Uh, oh, Pacino was first. This is hard. and We're going to have to have some people helping us. Stoney, I got you already. Uh, uh, Liam, um, I got you on the other one. Steve Lemur, I got you. Pino, I'm going to give one to Pino. And if I don't have you, don't worry, guys. We're going to have more of these. Uh, we have a lot more, like a thing that I didn't see uh, earlier. I see you, James. I see what can you say. I see you, ES, but I'm skipping you guys. Kevin George, I see you. If you've already claimed, I'm just going to skip you and try to give one to everybody. Uh, Jason B, Ben LaRouche, I got you. I got uh, Jeff Filbert. Where's that name? Right there, Jeff Filbert. 
Um, King Cough, Tino C, Tino C. Who else? Okay, got one. Yeah, take me out. Yeah, sorry, Ben, but don't worry. You're going to have a chance to claim more um, um, in the future. Uh, Ricky Royce, that's uh, uh, Rick Rulon. And Jason B on YouTube. There you go. Thanks, Jason, for join us and joining us on YouTube. Make sure to like the video and share the video and subscribe to the channel. Michael Amell. Yes, we do, but not today. Steve, uh, Kevin Leroux. Yes, I got you. All right. Oh, Mace is the king. I didn't get you last time. Mace. I got you, Mace. And Ricky... Okay, and the rest of you guys I got already, so we're good. We're good. We're good. We're good. All right, let's do the last box, and then we're out of here, and I go home for the weekend. It's the freaking weekend, man. We have some stray dogs. Michael, you said you're not going to be here on the 14th. So we're gonna have for all you for all you um how's the lag? Should be no lag, should be no lag. I like to see your I, I like you see timestamps. Yeah. Yeah, that's cool for sure. I just I didn't even know that. I just saw that now. Yeah. Lag test. I just saw it pop up. I'm watching the screen. Do it again. Do it again. Do another like this. I'm watching the screen now. Uh, 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 uh. Uh, about 13 seconds. Really? Well, so I guess there's no sorry. YouTube is just superior. I guess so. Last box. Here we go. A lag check for uh, uh, Philbert. Phil, it's hard to remember your names. And Lag tech's uh, Dominic. Yeah. All right. The last box. Now, this box, somebody was asking me, if these were all mine or something. This box, I kind of spent a little bit of money on. <laughs> Let's just say I spent a little bit of money um, out of my own pocket, but it was worth it. Well worth it. Okay, let's see what we start with. Woo! Venom number 33, Gleason. I think that's off the website. Congrats to you. YouTube is more open community. Facebook is like bubbles. Yeah. Another one, 9.8. So two trade dresses. Those are expensive books. Uh, another one. So a lot of people must have grabbed that off the website. Oh, somebody's happy. Brom, these yours? How much are those? I don't know, Juan. Uh, check out the website. Let me let me check out the website for you. Let's let's you know what? Let's check out the website together. So Tuesday night, guys, after our party show is going to be something like this. We're going to be doing a live show after the new comic book day. So you can get one for 90 and add the CGC. And it looks like we only have the signed ones available. But I'm pretty sure we had some uh, blue label as well. I don't know where they went. You'd have to message me. Trade dress are sold out, but I could probably break a set down. I have a set here for 240, but I could probably uh, break down the set if you wanted just the trade or just the virgin. But you'd have to message me after the show. So 
So, yeah, check that out. Guys, if you don't know, if you're watching for the first time, hit us up on Telegram. Telegram's a great place. Uh, definitely interesting to come and talk to us and click with the group. All right, let me go back to this, the last box, the last box. Uh, mention what's going on, the site for sale. Yeah, sales, man. There's a lot of good stuff on sales. Um, we're actually, Jason, since you brought that up, we're actually fixing up the front page. Right now it looks like crap. I just, I went in there and I erased a bunch of stuff and it just, it's, it's hopefully by next week, look at this, it's crap. It looks like crap. I messed it up uh, and I asked Kitty if she could take some time to hopefully uh, touch it up a little bit. So, so when you guys come here, you can, instead of going to our exclusives and stuff, you could just scroll down and we're going to have like, well, already we have the new exclusives that are out and we have the far side exclusives that are out, but we're also going to have, um, you know, the bundles and stuff that Angels of Atlas looks like mine. No, not that one. Not those ones. Uh, you should do a buy. Yeah, we should. We're going to be doing a lot of that kind of stuff. Uh, wait till you see Tuesday nights. I don't know if you, well, Jason, you're part of the Telegram group. Um, we've been, after the live show, we've been uh, offering books to you guys that are still available for, for reorder. So we're going to have an after party show on Tuesday nights where we can actually sit down together and check what is uh, available for, for you guys to still order. And I was even thinking that we should do a show where we go on Previews World. Oh, you're not even seeing my screen. Hold on. So we should go on to Previews World together and we could look at it together and we could search for books that are still available. So, you know, somebody might be like, um, give me, um, give me, let me see if, uh, I don't know, Hulk, uh, 19, I don't know. So we could come here, um, and basically check the cover. And with this code, I could go right away and let you know if it's available and take orders for anybody that still wants them, if they're available. Now, of course, all those keys and special books, most of them are, are already sold out. But we have found some really interesting books while doing this. But now we can do it together where we share a screen and I place the orders right away. So... There we go. Back to the show. Okay. Yeah. We we got I got lots of ideas, uh, guys. Uh, this is still brand new for us. So, okay, moving on. Okay, this one from the website Harley Quinn 75. I think that's the final issue. Nice looking book. 98. Another Venom. This time it's a Virgin. Guaranteed 9.2 or better. Came back 9.8. And I'm going to skip all that. Another one. Another 9.8. Thank you, uh, Gleason, for the good books. 9.8. Uh, Geiger. Geiger number one. Is that the glow in the dark? I think it is. Yes, that's the glow in the dark. That's mine, he said. Maybe. Which one's yours? Geiger? Is Geiger yours? Which one? Which one is yours? Okay, this one was uh, an example of a book that the client bought off the website. And when I saw it, it was mashed up a little bit. So I pressed it for them just because I was afraid that it wouldn't come back 9-2 or better, even though it was a back issue. So we don't really guarantee any grades on back issues, but I just felt bad sending this in and it being like, an, you know, it just took a little press to, to, to get the bump. Because if not, it would have came back a, an 8.5 or a 9. 
maybe a 9.2, but anyways, it needed a press. So I hope the client is happy with that. I don't know who it is. It's some random person off the website. Uh, so, Oh, another gagger number one. The uh, Oh, that's uh, Mr. Jason Fabok. Firepower 4. You want me to look for Firepower 4? Uh, oh, here's one that came back 9.6. So one one had to come back 9.6 just to just to unbalance everything. Um, another 9.8 though. Uh, geez, this is all Venom. I'm sorry, Venom 33 Virgin. Oh, Sheldon, there's your book. I think that's Sheldon's Hellions number 10. Good thing we didn't send another one out. Sometimes uh, people message us, "Where's our books?" and um, we scramble because CGC is so messed up that we don't even really know where the books are. They're sent in. We just sit and wait. That's all you can do. So I believe this is Sheldon's. I think he was uh, looking for it. Okay. There he is. Um, and a silk number one virgin, uh, Kale New. That's off the website, I believe. All right. And up next. Whew, I got a lot of goodness up next. Look at that, all that. So, so one of my spec books is War of the Realms, New Agents of Atlas. Uh, I think I have some without the first appearances written, but these first appearance of Luna Snow, Wave, Crescent, and the first U.S. appearance of Arrow. I think that's two today. Yeah, could be, could be. I, I remember this. I remember the Hellions because you were asking about it, but um, I don't remember the other one. So I went a little bit overboard. Seven, eight, nine, ten. There you go. Picked up ten of those bad boys, and I think I got more coming. Um, that's a good book to pick up. It's still cheap. Well, not really cheap, but uh, definitely uh, a good book to pick up. Yeah, ten on ten. And I'll be perfectly honest with you. I hate to say this, <laughs> I didn't press them. <laughs> I, I, I pressed one or two of them because one or two of them were, were you know, they needed some love. But besides that, I, I did not press those books. I don't know. Maybe one or two, max. Holy moly. Right? Right. So, I don't know when I'm going to sell those books. Hopefully on a rainy day, but um, or if they ever let us, if they ever let us go live on whatnot or what, what is it, whatnot? It seems like a big, powerful U.S. platform. Um, maybe one day um, we can get on there and we just show them what we're all about. Yeah. For now, for now, we're on YouTube, Facebook, Telegram, Twitter. Right now, the book is selling nice. Yeah. It can only go up, right? <laughs> That's for sure. The only way is up for that book. They're worth uh, 200 250 Yes, we do have. I've had a 9.9 and a 10. I have a 10. I sold my 9.9 Power Rangers, and I had the mall, the mall, 9.9. And I have a 10 um, uh, Donald Who Laughs, the Donald Who Laughs. Any regular live show after this? Well, I do have some random books here. Let me put these up. Hold on. 9.8 is 300 now. Really? I thought it was a little under that. I thought it was a little under that. And this is only part of my War of the Realms collection. I still have another 10 um, already 9.8s. So I guess I'm close to 30 or something. 
All right, so um, I do have some books, random books um, that I'm going to put up. I can be wrong. Yeah. Oh, yeah, it's close to 300, though. It's not far. Okay, some random stuff just to close out the show uh, for sale books, the slabs. I have a 9.8 Spawn 146. Beautiful Spawn cover. 9.8 for only 100 bucks. That's Spawn number 146. And after that, I got a couple more. Jason says there's a timer somewhere so we can put a timer and um we can even invite people anybody want to be on who, who's got books for sale we can do we can do uh far side comic con where you guys show off your books and maybe we can sell them for you okay nobody for the spawn let me see what else i have okay this one's quite expensive i'm going to put the price down I'm going to take 15% uh, off. A beautiful book. I took 15% off for the Amazing Spider-Man number 55. Second print. That is the 1 in 25. I had it at 230. Yeah. Let me know if that's interesting. I could be wrong. Could be. Okay, moving on. I've got a couple more. Just... Just showing them off since they're here. Uh, $80 Star Wars, The High Republic, number one, 9.8. Hot book. That's the uh, first appearance of at least three or four characters. Cheapos. Also got the Jiang foil. This is the foil, 9.8. For Star Wars Adventures number one, going for 150. One of these days, I have to get some graded books. Right now, just trying to get back into collecting. Yeah, well, take your time. Graded books are fun. Choose the right ones because it's quite addictive. I love graded books. Almost my whole collection is graded. Oh, I have two of those foils. Interesting. I did not know that. Um, how about the Star Wars High Republic Adventures? The uh, incentive, I believe it's a 1 in 10 or a 1 in 25 for 115. And I've got a sculpt, scalped, scalped um, Netflix show. Was it Netflix? I'm not sure. First appearance, uh, sculpt number one. I don't know what I charge it for CBS. I uh, should send these slabs back in better mylars. Yeah. If you buy off the website, we give you a mylite. Um, I don't really know the price yet, uh, Jason. I sent in uh, an order, and I'm about to send in my second order. And um, I'm kind of afraid that I didn't do it right so that they're going to end up charging me more. So I can't really tell you that I, you know, had no interest in graded that I met John. <laughs> I'm sorry, Steve. Sorry, not sorry. Because these are, you know, graded is definitely fun. Okay, this I'm going to just put it down lower in case somebody wants it. And I take 25 bucks off. 25 bucks off. Comes with a COA. Limited to only... 
250. This is number 87 of the Jiang Ice Cream Man, number 22. 9.8. Beautiful Jiang slab. Let me know. It's yours for 175. I love, I have very few because I'm very poor. Yeah, it's expensive. It's definitely, you know, definitely expensive. That's a sick cover. That's right. It is. Okay, uh, we have the Amazing Spider-Man um, 55 third print for only 80. Nice little pickup right there. $80. And if you like that virgin, you might like its little friend, the graded 9.8 Ice Cream Man trade dress for only 100 from Jiang. That comes with a koa as well. Yeah, yeah, we got more slabs coming. Lots of slabs, always slabs, slabs, slabs. Um, this one, this is the I think this is the last one we have like this. This is a nice one, um, super cheap. Dark Knight Death Metal number three with the Robin King on it, looking like Ozzy Osbourne for only 55. Look at that, 9.8. That's what's up, Steve. We appreciate that. That's definitely that's definitely appreciated. So 9.8 Dark Knights Death Metal number one for only 55 bucks. That's like that's the cost of uh, uh, of of uh, of the slab basically in the book. So so that's all I have, guys. Thank you. Thank you for tuning in. Make sure to like the video, share the video, subscribe to the page, tell everybody we're on Instagram now. We got a Donnie Cates. Oh, double signed for 135. That's like giving it away. That's totally cost price. That's probably below cost price. Uh, Absolute Carnage number four, double signed by Cates and Stegman. So uh you're welcome liam i hope that was fun i hope that was different um you know just trying to keep it new and refreshing brom lee claim you're claiming the hulk this was pretty dope hey you thank you john uh thank you mace brom lee this is the first time we did something like this and it was uh it was different it was fun i like today's show you're doing good hey thanks man you guys keep me going i wake up <laughs> i wake up and i see the comments i'm like shit i gotta do this i gotta do this thanks to mitch mitch uh joel he helped us find the camera and the mic and uh it directed us in the right direction to get this going. Um, so thanks, Mitch. Any other shows planned today? N don't think so. Uh, Thomas uh, did not come in today. He didn't feel well. So maybe there's a soccer game or something. I don't know. <laughs> yeah. You should do this every week. Well, every time we have CGC, uh, you know, I plan on doing more and more videos. Um, what we could do, what we could do is uh, FOC together. You know, did you guys order your DC today? Because today was the cutoff. Yeah, it's different than selling, right? Spending This is like spending quality time just hanging out. Uh, the man thing is tired, right? Can ship with my Gleason Venom. Uh, 
Yeah, well, yeah, for sure. In the next shipment, so I put you down for the Hulk. Uh, well, it's up absolute carnage number four. Yeah, feel better, Thomas. Little Thomas, feel better. So, yeah, so you guys, uh, do your DC yet? DC, I think it, we're done. Um, but you still have time to get your FOC done for Marvel and Indy. Hopefully everybody knows how to do this. If you don't, you can ask. We even got bundles up now, like this one. Oh, all these four are bundles right now. Um, the Spawn bundle is freaking awesome. I don't care if you're if you're not even a Spawn fan, it doesn't matter. You need to get this. Look at that, Matina. Poof. Sheesh. That is gorgeous. And we offered 9.8 for this. I forget what the price was, but we did offer a 9.8 of this Matina. And it is gorgeous. And it's gonna look it's gonna look amazing with the blue label. Um, and and oh, if we get it signed with the yellow label with this, oh, that's gorgeous. Oh, yeah, really nice. So you get two books, you get both covers. You get the uh, medieval spawn. That's okay, Mace. You're my only friends too. I spend I, I don't spend time outside of the group. If you're on Telegram, you're my friend, man. I'm talking to you every day. I'm, uh, you know, we're arguing every other day. We're, uh, you know, that's that's what friends do. So this guy, this guy, this artist is amazing. He is so damn good. So, yeah. Yeah, and this one's cool too. If you, uh, I guess I don't know why they're going. Um, I don't know what the the reason for the the native uh, um, variants, but because they did that a couple months ago, I, I, I don't. I guess I don't know. It's an ongoing thing, so. Yeah, so that's it, guys. Uh, make sure to check out the coming soon sections too. If you missed FOC, we have a lot of books still available. What? That's crazy price. So yeah, guys, check us out uh, wherever you wherever you are, whether it's a Facebook, uh, Instagram, Telegram. Uh, wherever we are everywhere uh, I'm waiting for a connecting three covers one second uh, show marks here. won't be long guys just trying to connect something Ay, 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 computer slow. Come on. There you go. There you go. I had to fix that price. That price was crazy price. Uh, the storyline is about various American citizens adopting, adapting the Canadian American title. Oh, Captain America title. They did that for number two. Yeah. I'm waiting for the connecting three covers for King Spawn number one, Gunslinger Spawn number one, and one other one. 
Oh, it's connecting. I didn't watch that video. Is he telling us that it's connecting with the other books? I thought it was like all connecting with, uh, you know, uh, King Spawn. All right, guys. Well, have a good night. Uh, maybe talk to you later or check us out on uh, on uh, Telegram. And that's about it. Um, I hope you have a good day. And. Yeah, that's it. That's what's up. So, make sure to check us out at Free Comic Book Day. And that's it. I need an outro. I don't have an outro. No outro. I had an intro, but no outro. Well, next time, you're going to see we're going to have an outro. See you next time, guys. Yeah, have a good day. Make sure to share, like, and subscribe. Like, comment, subscribe. Yes, sir. Thank you, guys. Have a good day. Peace.